Cause your life just needs saving Do the wise thing Call wise man lawyers Does your life just need saving Do the wise thing Call wise man lawyers Don't face that court alone Let the wise man team get you back on the road Does your life just need saving Do the wise thing Call the wise man team Black wise man All right, today I'm at Proserpine Magistrates Court, about uh, 20 minutes uh, inland from Airlie Beach. A uh, client was charged with repeat DUI drink driving, reading a point 083, was his uh, fifth drink driving offence. Uh, he had previous, uh, quite a bit of previous, uh, last one was point uh, 168, a high range. He had two uh, other high ranges, both, strangely enough, dead on point 157, and there was also a previous mid-range reading a point 103. Uh, so yeah, he had three previous high range, one previous mid range. Uh, this was a low range, so basically low range starts at 0.05 and goes up to 0.009. Mid range starts at 0.100, goes up to 0.149 and high range kicks in at 0.150. Uh, so as much as my job was one of getting the disqualification down as low as possible, it was also making sure, uh, one of making sure that nothing worse happens. So as you can imagine, with repeat drink driving, uh, you're getting into jail territory. So uh, as, as I said, as much as my job was one of minimizing the disqualification, it was one of ensuring that that and a fine only was all that happened. Uh, I won't get into it now, but there's a number of options available to a magistrate uh, if they want to uh, give harsher penalties, um, you know, namely imprisonment, which can be handed down in various uh, forms uh, or probation or stuff like that. But again, I'm not gonna go into that now. Um, that said, his previous was outside of the last five years. So within the last five years, he had no history of uh, DUI drink driving. But that said, he did have a uh, previous demerit point suspension that time. So he was not eligible to apply for a DUI drink driving work license. To be able to apply for a DUI drink driving work license, you can't have lost your license for any reason in the last five years uh, because he had due to demerit points. That just simply wasn't an option. Uh, given the previous drink driving was, again, outside of the last five years, uh, the penalty range is as if you don't have previous. I mean, the magistrate still obviously uh, has mind of the previous, but the fixed mandatory penalties uh, don't move. So worst case today was a nine-month loss of license. I mean, magistrates do have a general discretion to give more than that, but the, the relevant section gives a, a maximum of nine months, a mandatory minimum of one month. Um, but again, his reading was quite up there uh, for a low range, 0 0.083. So you're getting close to the uh, uh, mid range. So obviously, halfway between 0.05 and 0 0.090 is 0 0.175, and he was 0 0.083. So he's sort of on the wrong side of the halfway mark. Um, plus, he had all that previous. So. Um, Anyway, as far as preparing goes, I got him to do the course that we get everyone to do. It can be done online now. Uh, basically, it's over three evenings, about nine hours worth of online content. Got him to get some references. Um, just as a side issue, today uh, was a bit of a um, uh, comedy of errors of such. Uh, the regular magistrate called in six, so there was, was it was very much looking like um, I was going to have to fly back up here, which would have been a problem for me because... We offer fixed fees, so if I had, have, had to have come up twice, it would have been my cost, not the client's. Um, but what ended up happening was uh, a Brisbane magistrate appeared via video link, so um, ironically, I flew up from Brisbane to appear at Proserpine, uh, and the magistrate appeared via video link from Brisbane to deal with the matter. But in any event, you know, uh, magistrates are human, they get ill like everyone else, and um, you know, if you gotta have a sick day, you gotta have a sick day, but I guess what I'm getting at is, for a while there, it was looking like I was going to have to fly back without an outcome and either fly back to Prosperine on a later date or um, you try to appear by phone or something like that, which I don't like doing because, you know, you can only uh, be so effective by phone, in my view. You really need to be there in person to be able to gauge the room and gauge the magistrate, gauge the prosecutor, and, you know, it's more than just words being spoken down a phone line. You know, the art of persuasion is... Uh, about being present rather than uh, phoning it in for want of a better uh, description. But in any event, um, got my client to do the uh, course, handed up uh, the documents, uh, the 
references that I provided from the client, the uh, Prospine Registry fax down to uh, Brisbane, so the magistrate down there could read them while listening to me via video link. Um, I made a submission to the magistrate that uh, notwithstanding his history and the reading that a disqualification of six weeks would be appropriate. Um, you know, a lot of people seem to think that the magistrates must give units of one month. That's not the case. They can give, uh, you know, six weeks or ten weeks, whatever. Um, I pushed that quite forcefully, but the magistrate, given the history, given the reading, wasn't going to budge any lower than two months. And to be fair, given my client's reading and history, that's a, I'm happy with that outcome. So it was my client. I don't think he reasonably expected it to be a month, which is the mandatory minimum. And even though I sort of alluded to it in my submissions, I seriously didn't expect to get it either. But the bottom line is he's got a two-month disqualification, fine only. There was nothing more serious given as in probation or imprisonment, suspended or otherwise. Uh, so obviously he's off the road. He's going to have to make alternate arrangements during the two-month period. But obviously he's done it before with his previous offending. Uh, he'll do it again. Uh, and, yep, gets to go home to his family, put it behind him, move on. Uh, I'm Andrew Wiseman at Proserpine Magistrates Court. Thanks for watching. Hi, I'm Andrew Wiseman from Wiseman Lawyers, Queensland's only truly dedicated drug, alcohol and traffic events law firm. If you face loss of licence, loss of vehicle imprisonment or anything in between at any court in Queensland, we can and will help you today. This is our specialty. This is all we do. Give us a call, 1300 947 352. I look forward to helping you resolve your issue today. Don't face that court alone. Let the